This would be the second protest this year by workers and farmers at the Irrigation Company of Upper Region, ICO, against the managing director, Dr. Bonaventure Aligibam. For many years, they have been displeased with Dr. Aligibam's leadership style, and several protests aimed at removing him have yielded no results. In his tenor, we have experienced the worst ever productivity. Down, farmers are crying. He came and met Ico, and he will leave, and Ico will grow, and productivity of the farmers will increase. The country will get more food. He has got a gymnastic style of management, divide and rule management. So we want him to go because he will go to board and say a different thing. When he comes to staff. We are suffering. He has a different plan altogether. We have a calendar, I mean, cropping calendar. Since he came, that calendar has been squashed. Rice cultivation is a timely one. If you crop and meet the Hamatan season, you are dead. And for him, he doesn't care whether we meet whatever uh, uh, climate. He wants his money. Now, members of the General Agriculture Workers' Union of the Trade Unions Congress at ICOR are raising concerns regarding Dr. Aligibam's continual stay in office despite being directed by the Chief of Staff to proceed to retirement. The union embarked on a protest march to the Kasana Nankana Municipal Assembly in Navrongo where they petitioned the office of the President through the MCE. A letter from the Minister for Agriculture, Honorable Brian Achampo, granting Dr. Aligban three month extension, post retirement extension, was conveyed to him electronically by Honorable Stephen Yakubo. Dr. Aligban rejected the mode of delivery as unacceptable and maintained that he had not received the letter. Meanwhile, he was forced to pay himself salary for the three months which he was granted in that same letter using internal generator funds. Honorable Stephen Yakubu then subsequently printed hard copies of that letter and delivered him through a messenger to Dr. Aligbam. Dr. Aligbam has since remained in office claiming that he has not received the letter and has therefore not handed over his office. We submit ourselves to supporting the board and the regional minister to resolve this matter once and for all. Kasana Nankana Municipal Chief Executive Joseph Adongo received the petition and promised he would immediately send it to the Upper East Regional Minister for onward transfer to the President's office. Dr. Bonaventure Aligbam, when contacted for his reaction to the concerns of the ICO Workers Union, declined comment. For Joy News, Albert Sori, Navrongo.